Dun, 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 dun. Matt Picks. Welcome to another edition of Matt Picks. Ah, I do that because that was what I'm doing. Today on Matt Picks, we're featuring one of my all time favorite sodas. What do we have today? Today, we'll, we'll, we'll say it in one sec. Okay. Now, I went down a list because uh, some of my favorite sodas consist of Cactus Cooler, which may actually still be on the show because I don't know if that's a widespread soda or not. It's amazing. Um, we have some Mountain Dews like Code Red, stuff, stuff like that. Uh, but one of my, this is kind of, this one's been recent. In the last couple of years, I discovered this one due to the show. Uh, this is Iron Beer Soft Drink. Now, when you first hear that, you think, I think it's like an alcoholic beverage. I was like, dude, I don't want to drink beer right now. Yeah. Well, no. It's actually a, a soda that's been around since 1917. Oh, awesome. And Old Man Tom originally discovered this because he would go out uh, with his uh, now wife to certain uh, Middle Eastern restaurants, and they serve this. This is, a very, this is a very casual, normal thing that they would have out there. Okay. So we've discovered it from time to time. Uh, we got this specific one at Galco in Pasadena. It's our savior. Best thing ever. So he's never had this before. I like throwing on Matt Picks, occasionally throwing somebody on that hasn't had what I give a five out of five Matt Fixes. Because this is a five out of five. This stuff is delicious. I actually bought two. I was going to have you have one and me have one. I, I drank it. <laughs> this stuff is ridiculous. What's so, what makes it so special? Smell it. Now, what it is, is it's an interesting smell, isn't it? It's root beer combined with orange flavor. Oh. It's, an or it's basically an orange flavored root beer. That sounds delicious. It's it's amazing. So have an open mind. Drink that down. See if you agree or not. You don't have to, but here we go. Oh, it's so good. It's so unique. Wow, that is really good. It's really unique, though, right? Like, when I first tried this, it's the first soda I've had in years where I took a sip, and I was like, I've never I've never had anything like that before. It was really good. The closest you get to is maybe a cream soda, an ice cream soda. Yeah. But, wow. This tastes like you put a 50-50 bar and dipped it inside of root beer. And then took it out and licked it. <laughs> That's exactly what it tastes like. It's damn good. And I think this one jumped up from a, like a four to a five with me because it's so hard to find. Um, and and maybe buy only it have, you can. I only have it maybe once every you know couple of months. Um, I know there's a Mexican restaurant that, that sells them, but they sell them in the big liter bottles. And I don't really want those. Um, so yeah, it's a, it's a rarity for me, but I really love this stuff. I know Old Man Tom thinks it's a five out of five too. It's one of our yeah. personal favorites. See, this is awesome. It's really good. Some more. There you go, guys. Iron beer. If you can find it, try it. I know it's it's everywhere, just in the nooks and crannies of everywhere. So if you can get it, give it a shot. The nooks and grannies. The nooks and crannies. All right, this has been another edition of Matt Picks. Happy birthday. <laughs>